Did you know that approximately 100,000 fake degrees are sold annually in the US alone? Yes, fake college diplomas are no joke. It's important that you know how to detect them. So here is what you need to know. Hi, I'm Santiago from Great Hacker, the non-traditional student's most trusted resource. Now, there are two types of fake schools. The first one is the open diploma mills. These are transparent with their clients and straight up say they sell fake degrees for cash. You know their diploma is illegitimate when you buy it. These are websites like Cheaper Than Tuition and Phony Diplomas and while they clarify that the realistic diplomas are not validated nor should they be used as replacement documents, there is nothing stopping people from actually doing it. Buying a fake diploma is not illegal, but using it as an accredited degree for personal gain is a crime in several jurisdictions. The second type are those that claim to be real schools. These are the companies that trick students. They advertise themselves as real schools where their students do minimal work and earn their degrees in a short time. The danger is that many students get to graduate from these facilities and think they have actually earned an actual degree, but in reality they can get in legal trouble if they are caught using these fake credentials while working. Do you have years of experience working in a field? Would you like to get a college degree without having to spend thousands of dollars? And do you want to get that degree now? Hey, I'm Santiago, not a scammer, and we want to recognize hard workers like you with the diploma you deserve. Get a better job by earning a degree here. You only need to have two things, experience and give us your credit number. And that's it. By paying the small fee of $2,000, you can get a degree in just 30 days. Yeah, you heard that right. 30 days. So stop wasting your time and study here at the Higher Institute of totally not a fake college academy. We are waiting. These are the schools that you should avoid at all costs, and here is how you can identify them. The simplest and most effective way to find out if an educational institution is legit is by checking if it's approved by the Department of Education or the Council on Higher Education Accreditation. These fake institutions have names similar to well-known colleges and use official sounding terms such as licensed, authenticated, and internationally approved in their websites and apps. And to look even more real, they mention that they are accredited by a well-sounding institution, which really is another fake agency they have created themselves. Wait a second there. Before we continue, like and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any of the great college tips we have coming. Next we have the marketing campaigns. On their website I email spam, you can see how they focus heavily on the extreme promise of earning a degree in 30 days. Another way to tell is that their website won't have a .edu address and they won't share a phone number to get in touch with, only emails. And if they show an address, check that it's real as sometimes they are an apartment number or are located in another country. This is a super important red flag to take into account. Fake colleges charge one bill for the degree, unlike legitimate institutions that usually charge per course tuition or credit hours. Their prices range from $500 to $2,000 for an undergraduate degree and over $3,000 for a graduate diploma, which is way cheaper than what an actual degree costs. Also, they don't have any admission criteria. They don't ask you to meet a certain GPA, pass an entry exam, or present previous academic credentials. The final way you can recognize a fake school is by the program's length. Fake online degrees only last a few weeks or one or two months and this is because they don't really have any learning experience to provide. How could anyone think a degree is possible in such a short amount of time? Well, these schools target non-traditional students who already have working experience in one field and need to earn a new certificate to continue working or earn a better position. So if we add the good looking and professional design, the cheaper costs and the recognition by well-named institutions, the promise of a degree based on experience doesn't sound that impossible. Now, what do you do if a fake college scams you? 
send that institution an email explaining that you have realized your scam, that the degree they are offering is not legit and that you want a full refund. Full disclosure, it's highly unlikely that they will refund you or even answer your email. Still, you need to set the precedent that you were initially unaware of the fake diploma and that when noticed, you wanted to end it. Then, you can file a complaint with the Federal Trade Commission or with your state attorney general. You should also get in touch with the Better Business Bureau where you can easily fill out their complaints form. We'll leave all of these communication links down below. Fake college degrees are scams that trick non-traditional students into paying too much money for a diploma that isn't real and that could put them in legal trouble. But if you follow these red flags, it will be impossible for you not to recognize a fake school if you ever get to see one. That's it for today. Be sure to like and subscribe to our channel and share us with your friends so they can keep track of the best college tips too. Also, go ahead and share us in the comments if you have ever encountered a fake college and the what you did with it. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. If you are a non-traditional student and still haven't found the school for you, check out our list of the best colleges for non-traditional students and find which scholarships you can apply for before starting.